Hello guys and welcome back. In this video I'm going to talk about Mafia game timeline and before I even begin don't forget to subscribe and the like button down below, I would really appreciate it. And there is 4 main series in the game, let's get into this, enjoy watching. Mafia is 2002 action adventure video game developed by Lucian Softworks and published by Gathering of Developers. The game was released for Microsoft Windows in August 2002 and later ported to the PlayStation 2 and Xbox in 2004, set within the factional city of Lost Heaven during the 1930 century. The story follows the rise and fall of taxi driver turned a mobster Tommy Angelo within the Salieri crime family. Mafia's storyline gameplay consists of thriving mainly easy city cruises between different locations as well as chase and race. The rest of the game is based on a third person on foot, navigation and shooting, all interconnected within the cutscenes. In addition to the city and the countryside detailed interests like the city's airport, museum, a church, a hotel, abandoned prison, a restaurant and Don Salieri's bar are included. And the other changes day and night. Mafia 2 is a 2010 action adventure game developed by 2K Czech and published by 2K Games was released in August in 2010 for Microsoft Windows PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360, a version consisting of previous downloadable content. Entitled Mafia 2, a director's cut was released by Feral Interactive in December 2011. The game is a sequel to 2002 Mafia and the second installment in the Mafia series set within a factional city of Empire Bay, a factional barrier of New York City, Chicago, San Francisco, Los Angeles, Boston and Detroit. During the mid-1940 and 1951, the story follows Vito Scaltia, a Sicilian-American mobster and war a veteran who becomes involved in power struggle among the city's mafia crime families while attempting to pay back his father's debts and secure a better lifestyle. The game is played from the third person perspective and it is a world is navigated on a foot or by a vehicle. The player character's criminal activities may incite a response from a law enforcement agency measured by a wanted system that governs the aggression of their response. Development began in 2003 soon after the release of the mafia first game. And it is a set nearly a decade after the first game, Mafia 2 takes place between two distinct time periods, the mid-1940 and early 1950 within a factional US city of Empire Bay. The game's first chapter takes place as an unnamed town within a Sicily, while the sixth is set within a prison somewhere outside Empire Bay. The city is statued on the United States eastern coastline and divided by the river and coastlines of several districts including a wealthy suburbs, slums and tenement. Blocks for the city different immigrant races including Irish, African, American, Chinese and Italian and a large scale industrial complex. Mafia 3 is a 2016 action adventure video game developed by Hunger 13 and published by 2K Games. It was released in October 2016 for PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and Microsoft Windows, and in May 2017 for Mac OS. It is the sequel to the Mafia 2 and the third installment in the Mafia series, set within a factional city of New Bordeaux, a base of New Orleans. In 1968, the story follows a former criminal and a Vietnam veteran, Lincoln Clay, who is forced to return to a life of a crime to help his adoptive family settle problems with the local mafia family. After the mafia betray and murder his family, Lincoln embarks on a quest for revenge while slowly building a criminal empire and seizing a power from the criminal organizations in the city. The development of Mafia 3 began soon after the Mafia 2 was released, but in Italy had problems. 2K Check, the developer of the series' first installments, oversaw a structure with much of the development team assigned to the company's new studio, Hunger 13, after deciding on recruiting in New Orleans 1968, the development team draw influence from the series' previous projects and designed the game around clay to replicate the core structure of it as a bread source. Much of the development work constituted the open world's creation and several team members conducted field research around Luciana to capture footage 
For the design team, the game's soundtrack features several licensed songs composed by a various musician who were active during the time period. And in 1968, a Vietnam veteran Lincoln Clay returns home to a new borido and returns with his surrogate father and black mob leader Sammy Robinson, his adoptive brother Alice, and his friend father James Ballard. While in Italy planning to leave for California, Lincoln agrees to stay and help Sammy, who is facing problems from the Haitian mob and adapted to mob boss Sal Marcon. Lincoln ends the conflict with the Haitian by killing their leader and meets with Marcon to see how can cover Sammy's debts. Although Lincoln dislikes his suggestion to take over the black mob from Sammy, Marcon nonetheless recruit him and Alice to help his son Georgie to rob the cities, a branch of a federal reserve during the local Mardi Gras celebration added by their friend Danny, whose father is also looking to settle matters with Marcono after a previous falling out. The group carry out the heist within a little complexion, but the Marconos turn on them and afterward killing Sammy and Alice and Danny. Lincoln is also shot and left to die in Sammy's bar after it is set on fire, but Father James finds and rescues him. The game is set in an open world environment and played from the third person perspective in which the player assumes control of Lincoln Clay as already mentioned before with the game world being larger than Mafia 1 and Mafia 2 maps. Combined Mafia 3 maps is made up of 10 districts Bayou, Ventum, Delory, Hollow players can complete objectives using a variety of approaches. For example, players can use a weapons provided in the game, like shotguns and revolvers, to eliminate enemies or call for allies who arrive in van and assist the players. Alternatively, they can make use of stealth tactics throughout the entire mission without being noticed by enemies. The core gameplay revolves around the gunplay, an additional player can also perform exacting moves and engage in melee combat. The game features cover system allowing the players to take cover behind objectives and avoid enemy or gunfire. A player can also interrogate non-playable character after defeating them in order to gain more information on their objectives like scaring them while driving a car, player can also attack and overrun locations owned by the Italian mob and assign one of their lieutenants to operate around the local area. The game allows players to drive a car from the era with realistic driving machines and sounds. Mafia Definitive Edition is a 2020 action-adventure game developed by Hunger 13 and published by 2K Games, a remake of 2002, a video game Mafia. It is the fourth main installment in the Mafia series, set within a fictional city of Lost Heaven. Based on Chicago during the 1930th century, the story follows the rise and fall of a Lost Heaven Sicilian-American movie star Tommy Angelo within a Salieri crime family. Alongside the story mood, player can also explore the city in open world mood, which features also mission and the ability to find secrets at their own leisure. They remake a broad within the several improvements to the original's story and gameplay, including rebuild setting, enhanced mission dynamic, and the introduction of motorcycles to the series, while most of the veteran Czech Mafia voice cast returned for the new installment, the English voice were recast. In addition, developers created the original score for the remake. The game was released for Microsoft Windows, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One on 25th September 2020, both individually and as a part of the Mafia tragically back which also includes a remastered version of the second game and a version of the third game. Conceived as a full remake of the original, Mafia Definitive Edition was built from the group up with a new assist and expanded story, although missions and arcs from the original game are carried over. As with the 2002 game, players control Tommy Angelo throughout the game's single-player campaign and it is a world is navigated on foot or by a vehicle. A new to the remake is introduction of motorcycle, a first in the series Mafia Definitive Edition gameplay machines are based 
on those of Mafia 3, a classic difficulty setting, is also included, as serving as the gameplay hardest difficulty setting that changes some gameplay machines such as ammunition management and the police response to the crimes bringing the game closer to the original 2000 game outside the main story mode a separated free ride mode is included as not to the original game allowing the player to explore the city at their own leisure without any mandatory mission objectives unlike the original game however free ride and free ride extreme are merged into one game mood with the letters outlandish and over the top side missions and corrupted into the main free raid segment as hidden secrets to be uncovered by the player a post release update released in october 2020 added new activities in the games free ride mode including taxi mission and racing mode which takes a place in the autodrome future and the mission fair play also include and the update is the ability to play the game in black and white leveled into the game settings menu as a noir mode as a homage to film noir movies of the era as well as various options allowing the player to show or hide parts of the game's hut and for the plot, in 1930, during the Great Depression, improvised a taxi driver Thomas, which is Tommy Angelo, is strong armed by two members of Salieri crime family, Paul and Lombardo and Sam, and to helping them escape an ambush by a rival Moriolo crime family, although he is offered a job and compensated for his help. Tommy Angelo returns to his job to the next day until two Moriolo family members attack him in act of revenge after Sam and Paul save him Tommy asks Don Eno Salieri for help and exacts to publish upon his attackers while agreeing to join the Salieri organization as associate assisting with the operation of Salieri Rackets across Lost Heaven. Overseen by his consigliere Frank Colty, he befriends Sam and Paul during the job they performed together while earning Salieri's respect by thwarting an attempt by a Morello family to take over one of his rackets. And this Mafia game is our mastered version of Mafia 2 with an updated graphics titled Mafia 2 Definitive Edition was released on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and Microsoft Windows on 19th May 2020. As I already mentioned before, the owners of the original Steam version had their copy of the game updated to Definitive Edition at no additional cost. The Definitive Edition, which includes all of the story expansion and style packs, was developed by D3T Litted. The definitive edition was later included in a Mafia trilogy pack, which was released on 25th September 2020, and also includes a remake of the first game titled Mafia Definitive Edition, and a version of Mafia 3 include all story expansion packs. And there's a six story expansion packs was released, and the first one is Mafia 2 The Betrayal of Jimmy. And the second one is Mafia 2 Jimmy's Vendetta and the game was released in 2010. And the third one is Mafia 2 Joe's Adventure. And the fourth one is Mafia 3 Faster. And the fifth one is Mafia 3 Sign of the Times. And the sixth one is Mafia 3 Stones Unturned. And the game was released in 2017. And those was the sixth story expansion packs. Thank you all for watching and thank you for your support and I will see you next time. Bye.